This week, the Alabama Governor's Youth Leadership Forum is on Troy University's campus, putting on their annual summer camp that helps teens with disabilities learn self-advocacy and how to be independent. Many times as teenagers and youth, they already have some kind of barriers where they're not always just so comfortable with speaking up for themselves, expressing their needs, their wants, their desires. When you have a disability, sometimes that's even a little bit harder. So we're working with them on being their self-advocate, speaking up, telling what their needs are, learning how to request accommodations if that's what they need, rather if it's on the job, if it's in college, just things so they can say this is who I am, this is what I need, learning about a support system. The YLF delegates heard from their peers on what it is like to live on their own and the possible challenges they may face. Then they participated in a budgeting activity where they budgeted out beans and learned tips on how to manage their funds. Their peers are talking to them about real life situations where where they've had to learn to wash their own clothes, where they've had to manage a budget, possibly having a flat tire. So I think when our students and our youth hear it coming from their peers, it means so much more than adults, grown-ups just telling them what they need to do. Cole Howell, a former delegate, now serves on staff and uses this opportunity to make an impact on these students' lives. It's really my goal to uh, serve as a positive role model and help the younger delegates to uh, learn how to take charge of their lives, be proactive, and take steps to live uh, fulfilling futures. YLF's week is jam-packed with activities and panels that will prepare these teens for life after graduation, but also trips to Montgomery to attend a Biscuits game and tour the state capitol where they'll meet legislators and the governor. The YLF camp is free of cost to parents and there are many ways to learn about how you can get involved. They can look on Alabama Department of Rehab Services um, website. We talk about YLF there, talk with their teachers, their vocational rehab counselors, their CRS staff. Um, it, we talk about it at transition conference so there's many opportunities where students can participate we talk with their parents we send them a good bit of information so if they have any questions they can reach out to us applications for YLF will become available in January Georgia Clark Troy Trojan Vision News